a old Chinese monk who has shared his experience, he told that, Dear students, anger is a strong feeling that can make people act in bad way. It can make our minds cloudy and stop us from thinking clearly. We can forget the things we've learned and be rude to others. It can destroy relationships and harm our bodies and minds. When we get angry, our bodies release stress hormones like adrenaline and cortisol. This can make our blood pressure go up and make us feel hot. If we get angry a lot, it can lead to headaches, stomach problems, trouble sleeping, and more. Our ancient teachings call anger a manus rogue or a mental problem. Anger can make us make bad choices and hurt ourselves more than others. We hold on to anger like a grudge and it only makes things worse. He shared a story that Leo was a tailor in a small village. He charged high prices because he was the only tailor in town. One day, an old lady wanted to work with him, but he was rude and turned her away. The old lady bought a sewing machine and started her own shop. People liked her and stopped going to Leo. This made Leo jealous and angry. To make things right, his wife bought the old lady's shop, but Leo burned it in anger. He didn't realize that his anger hurt him more than anyone else. So how can we get rid of anger from our hearts? Let's talk about it. Anger is a sign of a bigger problem, which is desire. When our minds get attached to things, we want them. If we don't get what we want, we get angry. To get rid of anger, we need to replace our material desires with spiritual ones. Desire to serve, desire for knowledge, and desire to be close to the divine can purify our minds and help us be less angry. But until we get there, we can use some life hacks to control our anger. First, find out what makes you angry. Is it when your children don't listen or when your parents push their ideas on you? Once you know your triggers, take a few deep breaths or count to 60 before reacting. This will help you think more clearly and make better choices. A story about a lady who took anger medicine from a sage shows how our left brain can help us calm down when we give it a chance. Dear friends, there's also a story about a man who decided not to fire his worker who made a big mistake. Instead, he wrote down the worker's good quality. This changed the factory's culture to be more understanding and kind, he said in the end. If we want to be less angry, we need to get rid of the mode of ignorance, which is like a dark cloud over us. To do that, be careful about what you see, hear, read, and eat. Eating less spicy food can help you have better control over your anger. Viewers, I hope these tips help you become a better and less angry person. Thanks for watching.